good afternoon viewers this afternoon we are going to be looking at a subject in social study a particular topic in social study that has to do with science and technology science and technology you are going to be listening to this topic in series this is the first series and the objective for this particular topic science and technology and society at the end of these teachings the student should be able to explain the meaning of science and technology and at the same time you should be able to mention the effects of science and technology importance of science and technology problems of science and technology and at the same time you should be able to explain the concept of technology transfer you may be wondering that what is science and technology doing in social studies it is very interesting that social study has to do with environment and social studies is the study of man and his environment due to the curiosity of man that is what brought about this topic now we we'll start with the meaning the meaning of science science is defined as the organized knowledge of the physical and natural world and phenomenon scientific processes include divination experimentation observation analysis and inferences now you should understand that science is actually helping the society to develop science they are curious to know how this world came to be scientists has gone far by trying to find out how god created the world and as man in the world due to our curiosity we want to know how things come about in the society and for us to achieve this they have their processes scientists they have their processes by divination by experimentation by observation by analysis analyzing things and by trying to inference what they are able to analyze now let us now see the meaning of technology it is defined as the method of applying organized knowledge to provide devices or means for solving practical problems you see as man we encounter a lot of challenges in the world but with the help of science and technology we are able to see how we can develop the crude ways of doing things the primitive ways of doing things we are not trying to use science and technology for us to be able to make our life our environment a conducive place a place where things can be easily done without struggling technology makes science to be useful for easy living of man thank god for science and technology for example in those days if you want to travel from one place to the other we trek we trek kilometers we trek long distance to get to wherever we are going to but with the help of science and technology we have been able to solve that problem a journey that may take like 3 4 days we can spend just 30 minutes this is as a result of science and technology now let us try to understand what we are discussing now science technology and society science and technology exists in the society due to man's curiosity 
about the world and his desire to improve his living conditions. Man is interested to improve his living condition. We don't want to be doing things the way it has been done in those early time. We don't want to be doing things in the olden days, in the in the in a way that things are not making progress, in a way that things are slow. But we want to advance, and that's the reason for science and technology in the society. We don't want to continue to do things in a primitive way. We don't want to be using those crude materials to be doing things. For example, agriculture. In those days, we make use of cutlass, we make use of oaks. But today, with the help of tractors, we can get our work done without suffering or without injury ourselves. You will discover that in those days, our forefathers, they easily get hold. Why are they getting hold so easily? It's because they input hard work, making use of hands to cultivate a large piece of land where tractor can easily help us to do it. So that's the essence of science and technology to help us get things done in a better way, in a easier way, and in a way that our health, our life will still be preserved. Science and technology brings about invention in our society. And it will be interesting for us to know the meaning of inventions. Inventions is the art of putting ideas and materials together to make a new thing. A thing that has never existed before. New things that are made are called inventions. So you must understand that things that have not existed before, through inventions, we bring them to life. For example, Alexander Graham Bell invented the telephone in 1876. That is an invention. If Alexander Abraham Bell did not come about how to invent the telephone, communication would be difficult. And this is the work of science and technology. Also, it will be interesting us to know the meaning of discovery. Discovery is the art of finding something that already exists before anyone else does. Something new that is found by someone is called discovery. When C. Rodgen accidentally discovered the S-ray in 1895. So science and technology existed in the traditional society. For instance, the early man invented the bow and arrow for killing animals. The type of technology adopted by society depends on the nature of the environment. So our environment will determine the kind of technology that will exist. So in the next series, we'll get to know more about science and technology. Thank you.